I recently took in a seminar with Michael Dopp, who teaches parishes how to evangelize their parish. And one of many things that I wrote down over those three days was this. We all want to do what we want without displeasing God too much. Now, this really stood out to me because I think there's something within us that wonders, how much can I get away with before I really, really blow it with God? And when this starts creeping up in our hearts, we have to realize that we need a conversion in that area of our life. Why? Because what we're really saying to God is, how little can I love you before I lose you in my salvation? Imagine if I went to my wife today and I asked her, how little can I love you before you get ticked off with me? In other words, how much can I be lazy? How much can I ignore you? How much do I have to talk to you and listen to your words? How much can I listen or how much can I think about other women or watch online porn before I offend you? Honey, how little can I love you before I lose you? Love doesn't ask this. Selfishness does. If this is our mentality we have with God or those we supposedly love, we need a change of heart. We have to make an intentional decision to take our eyes off of ourselves and place them upon God. Love doesn't ask the question, what can I get away with, but how much can I do for you? How can I please you? How can I serve you? How can I give more to you? Real love doesn't want to be outdone in love. A great prayer to say would be, God, help me love you more today than I did yesterday.